10 Facts About the Palace Cat These fluffy wildcats are the stars of YouTube videos, and internet memes. The palace cat, a Tocolibus model, is a small wild cat known for its unusual, and adorable, look, a flattened and rounded face, a stocky build, and super fluffiness make it appear stout and plush. But they're more than just pretty faces. Watch on to find out what else, makes the palace cat truly awesome. 1. The palace cat also goes by the name Mono. German naturalist Peter Pal is originally classified, the cat as Felis Mono in 1776. The word Mono has its roots in the Mongolian language. Its current scientific name, Otocolibus, comes from the Greek language, and can be translated to ugly aired. When Pallas first described the cat, he erroneously suggested it was the ancestor of the domestic Persian breed because of its long fur, stout build, and flattened face. 2. All that fluff creates the illusion of size. Pallas cat appear to be bigger and heavier than they actually are, due to their stocky builds and long, dense coats. In reality, they're about the size of domestic cats, they measure up to 26 inches in body length, with an 8 to 12 inch tail, and weigh only around 10 pounds. 3. They have unusual pupils. Unlike other cats, the pupils of palace cats contract into small circles, rather than vertical slits. 4. Palace cats are particular about their habitat. They live throughout Central Asia, from Western Iran to Western China. Within this range, palace cats prefer the cold and arid environments of rocky steppes, and grasslands at elevations up to about 15,000 feet. 5. Palace cats have the longest and densest fur. Their fur is nearly twice as long on their belly, and tail is on their top and sides. Presumably, this helps keep the cats warm, as they hunt on snow or frozen ground. The length and density of their fur also change seasonally, growing longer and heavier in the winter. Palace cats go through two major color phases. In the winter, their coats are grayer and more uniform in color, while in the summer they have more stripes, and ochre colors in their fur. They have black rings on their tails, scattered black spots on their foreheads, and dark stripes running from their eyes down their cheeks. Their coats frosted, silvery appearances due to the white tips on their hairs. 6. Palace cats are loners. They are solitary and territorial, with both males and females sin marking territories, of about 2 to 3 miles. Palace cats spend their days in caves, crevices, and burrows made by other animals, emerging toward dusk to hunt. 7. They have an extremely short mating season. Female palace cats are in estrus for only 26 to 42 hours, a shorter period than most cats. Mating occurs in February and March and females give birth to a litter of 2 to 6 kittens, in April and May. By 4 months old, the kittens begin hunting with their mother, and they reach adult size by 6 months. They're ready to breed at the age of 10 to 11 months. 8. Palace Cats are Ambush Hunters They stalk their prey using short vegetation and rocky terrain for cover, or sometimes wait at entrances to burrows, and pounce when their inhabitants exit. Palace cats prey mainly upon pikas, other small rodents, birds, and the occasional insect. 9. They're poor runners. The palace cat's compact body makes it a poor runner. When chased, it seeks refuge on boulders or in small crevasses. 10. Palace cats make a variety of sounds. They yelp or growl when excited, making a sound similar to a small dog. Palace cats can also purr. Thanks for watching, don't forget to like, share and comment down below, also activate the notify button.